Okay, so um, the other elements in my dream that <sighs> seem pretty important. Um, I was gathering with a bunch of females, one in particular that I knew from high school. Um, didn't wasn't really sure if I knew the other people. One in particular that um, I was bonded with. <laughs> I couldn't really put my finger on who who it was, but she seemed very familiar, but I couldn't recognize her by her face and stuff. But the, um, She looked kind of like um, like tall, blonde, like Charlize Theron or something. So it, it was like I knew her, but I didn't know her in person. So it was like something like that. But I just remember it was like this big complex of like all these cabins, like, you know, um, all these different like residencies uh, but like a community kind of thing and they were all coming and gathering and um, uh, I was like cleaning stuff like washing dishes cleaning out cupboards like just getting things all prepared and cleaned up and organized and um, I remember at one point um, I guess I was like going to sleep outside or I, or I went outside because there was about like four guys around a table talking and stuff. And I was just like, okay, I'm going to go to bed now, guys. And um, they're all really respectful and was were like, oh, okay, okay, have a good night. And then all of a sudden my brother-in-law, my late sister's um, husband, uh, said, hey, we're going to take the boat out tomorrow. Do you want to go? And I said, no. Oh, no, that's really nice, thank you, but I, I really need to go on a long hike, um, just get outside, be by myself, and go on a nice long hike. Um, and it was interesting, because when I, I was kind of prepared for the guys to be, like, disrespectful, they were just sitting around a table talking, they weren't doing anything, they weren't being loud or obnoxious, they were just talking, but I thought, you know, I'm, I'm going to sleep now, so, and they were really responsive and respectful, and, um, went inside and were like, oh, okay, all right, have a good night. And, um, and my brother-in-law was really sweet and invited me out on the boat. And, yeah, so, and then I was just really, like, in charge of getting things prepared, organized, cleaned up, figuring out who's sleeping where and in what room and blah, 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 and getting all the food together. And um, uh the one girl that I knew from high school, she was like my best friend. Um, she was someone who was quite promiscuous. And whenever I would tell her that I had a crush on someone, she would go mess around with them or like literally have sex with them. And um, even my first love, I remember being told by another uh, male friend who was a buddy of his that, they were messing around and it was just like, so I just stopped telling her who I liked. <laughs> but, um, yeah. So there was kind of that element of like being irritated, but she was there and she wasn't doing any of that stuff. But I just remember her like being there and, and me having that thought of like, are you where you're supposed to be? Are you sure you're supposed to be here? So yeah, just wanted to share that. Um, that was pretty much the main dream and right before I woke up. So um, angels must have thought it was important. So I just wanted to share that. Um, the other parts of the dream from the last post that I just uh, talked about with the, with the update with my twin flame. So that was all one dream. And So anyway, love you guys. Blessings to you all. Peace be with you all.